morning friends this morning thought is very relevant for all of us a journey of thousand miles begins with a single step friends this very thought is very relevant in everyone's life there is no denying the fact that every journey begins with a single step what does it mean any long journey whether it is a personal journey or professional journey it might be a long journey but it begins with a single step at a time you have to initiate one work in regarding your i mean journey you, you need not worry about the long journey or the tedious journey or the obstacles that you are going to face you may face a different of obstacles in the course of your journey that is not important what is important is that you should take the very first step this very thought is related to a story of a, a stephen king an american writer who whose success story is very much relevant to this quote actually a stephen king an american writer who specialized himself in writing science fiction fantasy and horror started writing short stories but despite his good ability and despite his best effort he got 60 rejections before his first short story was you know published and was sold for a meager 60 dollar you just you can just imagine when he started writing and when he got 60 rejections he never gave up he continued writing despite several rejections the the fact that stephen king went on doing multiple jobs for continuing his writing ability he lived with his wife in a tattered house but he never stopped writing he continued writing and you know the several years he struggled to uh, right but he never stopped his first step was to begin writing and when his first copy first short story was sold later on he he started writing and one by one his story got acknowledged by the world and by 2013 his hard bound copies 300 billion copies were sold just you, you can imagine that the man, the writer Stephen King, could have taken his journey as a long one, but in the beginning, his his just mind was to start writing. His short short stories could have been popular in the beginning, but they didn't get recognition. He continued struggling one by one. After sixty rejections. He should have stopped writing, but he never stopped. He never gave up. He continued writing. And the result was that he became a very successful writer. And the world acknowledged his ability of writing when his 300 billion copies got sold. He became famous. But the fact that the story also tells us that however difficult our journey personal, educational, financial may appear to us. Our journey may, our personal journey, our professional journey, our intellectual journey may seem a little bit long, tedious and full of challenges. But we should not worry about the length of the journey, the period of the journey, the time of struggle. We should start initiating the work by taking one step at a time. For instance, for a student who, who is very ambitious and is willing to crack all sorts of highly competitive exams like a UPSC and, you know, JE or NEET or any other exam. Yeah, and if he started preparing by mastering his concept, the conceptual learning he has mastered in all the subjects, he has done his first step. He, the, the, his journey has begun very well. So if you have begun your journey very well, then half of the work is done because well begun is half done. So when you initiate your journey in a better way, when you begin your journey and take the first step at a time, do not worry about the long and 
you know, a struggling journey. Do not worry about the obstacles that you are going to face. You are bound to face obstacles in the course of your journey. You are bound to have different types of impediments in the course of your journey. But should you stop going ahead in your life? If you want to reach your destination, you have to take one step at a time. And that step could be starting your, I mean, financial journey, could be beginning your work, could be starting studies, could be conceptualizing the in the, the content of the subject matter, could be appearing at the exams and learning from the failures, could be, <clears throat> you know, studying the primary and basic ideas of things, or could be continuing studying and learning every day, because every day you learn something and that can be applied in the latter part of your life. So a, a thousand miles journey may begin with a single step and the single step that you have to take at a time may be anything. It may be the initiative that you have taken to start your journey. It may be the planning that you have made for your journey. It may be the starting point of your journey. It may be simply the, uh, you know, the layout of your work, the, the plan, the strategy of your work, or it may be just simply doing, simply doing without thinking about what will be the outcome of your journey, how long the journey will take, how difficult it will be to reach the destination. Before talking about all these things, start one step at least of your journey. Begin with the work that you have to do. If you are a financial entrepreneur and if you to start a business, at least set up the business, start working on it. The Once you take the first step of start, uh, starting working at your, I mean, business and setting up your business, things will come on your way. <clears throat> For students who are studying and uh, are ambitious of cracking exams, for them, the first step is to master the concepts, to ca capitalize the, the concepts and knowledge and to apply the competency in mastering the you know, applications of those uh, questions that generally come in the exams. So applying your mind and skill in solving different types of questions for preparation of any competitive exams can be the first step in the long journey of cracking the exam. In the similar manner, for all types of students who are willing to do better in studies, they should be regular at their work. Their first step is to be punctual in the class, to attend to their, I mean, teachers and to listen to their parents, to interact with the seniors, those who have really been successful in life, to ask about how they have begun their journey, how they have initiated their first step of journey. The journey will not look long for you. It will be just uh, easier. The very first step, if you're taken in the right direction, the second step will be easier. And the third step and later on, all the steps will be far more easier than it appears to you. And that is why it is rightly said, this Chinese proverb rightly said, that a thousand mile journey begins with a single step. Thank you. Have a nice morning. This is Edison on the channel is English by Edison.